Hey, what's up guys? Wood here of Woods Custom 78. And as you can see, I'm standing next to a bike that we're about to release into the wild. It started off as a 2003 TSR 125, a two-stroke mini beast looking like this and now looking like this. So let me take you through real quick of the things that we did to transform this because we believe that things are better built than bought. So what did we do to build this, to improve on it, to make it feel cooler, just to give it at the Woods Customs touch? Let's go through this, shall we? All right, so first of all, as you can see, this bike has been built as a single seater. Our customer's specifics was that he wanted this to be a single seat adventure travel partner here in Davao City in the Philippines. He actually comes from Europe. But um, what we're doing today is we're gonna walk you through the improvements and changes that we made to make this bike super comfortable, super practical, and super fun. So let's have a listen to see how this beast sounds, shall we? <laughs> So what we did for this bike is that we upgraded what we could in accordance to our customers' requirements, obviously. So we replaced the front old school lights, the very plasticky covered lights, with these modern LED front lights. We gave it the bullet signal lights to give it that classic scrambler look, but we also kept it very modern feeling with the rear LED strip light, which obviously adds to the minimal vibe and practicality. And it's kind of cool that the turn signals are inbuilt in the strip light. So what we did was we replaced the very old, very banged up exhaust pipe and replaced it with our own custom built exhaust and pipe to give it this really sleek, very mean looking machine. And actually what it does is it created a little bit more power, it's a little bit more open pipe feel, as you'll hear from the sound. We added our exhaust wrap to the pipes just to give it that clean, classic look, and also functions as a heat guard for our rider. We upgraded the brakes. The original bike only had drum brakes, so we upgraded them to front and rear disc brakes so that the bike is not only looking good, but actually functions well and can stop which is obviously really important. This little two-stroke 125 packs a punch, I'm telling you. Our client also requested that he have some bar end mirrors. So we customized and extended the handlebar a little bit to be able to fit those bar end mirrors to give it that feel that he wanted. It's got a very classic speedometer, old school style. Everything on this bike has been built to feel like it's a nostalgia uh, moment every time you sit on it, but its functionality is something that's upgraded for today's riders. We customized our entire seat, created our own three layer foam technology to make it super comfortable. And the entire back end of this motorbike has been cut and rebuilt to fit the shape and flow of the build itself in its design. The tank was replaced on this motorbike motorbike with the classic other tank that we just customized to fit and so it just fits our design beautifully. The lines are straight, simple and clean which is exactly how we like it to be here in Woods Customs. We've kept the front being a 21 inch rim and the rear an 18 just like they do in the classic Enduros. We wanted to ensure that he had the clearance for all of his off-road adventures that he could want. As you can see, we kept the tires knobbly so that he's ready to take it off-road. They may not be perfect for all day, every day on the motorway, but they're good enough to be able to take you off-road and on an adventure of a lifetime. We've tried to build it so that all the wiring and the batteries are hidden. The battery is actually hidden underneath the seat with this custom side panels that we built. Everything is steel and metal and welded. So this will last as long as the rider takes good care of it. And it can take him on some pretty gnarly adventures, I'm pretty sure. This is truly a one-of-a-kind TSR125. I can guarantee you that you won't find one looking like this riding around here in Mindanao, southern Philippines. And I know that the new owner, he has adventure in his blood. So he's going to be taking this all over the city and up to the Bukit. That's the mountains here. He's going to have a lot of fun. This will truly be his adventure partner. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed just this really quick little walkthrough of one of our recent beasts. We've got a few just about to roll out real soon. So thank you for watching, and if you're interested, get in touch with us. Click on the link below, check us out on Facebook at Woods Custom 78 um, and if you're watching this on YouTube, we'll put a link down there too, uh, for you to be able to follow us if you have any inquiries. Not only do we build bikes, but we build bikes 
with a purpose. All of our projects here, this is part of our outreach and mission here to Davao City, Philippines. So for every bike that's built, for our customers or sold, you're investing in our educational projects, our sponsorship programs, our feeding programs, and our outreaches to some of the most needy communities here in the city where you're loving the children and the family. So not only are you gonna get a really cool bike, but you also have the peace of mind and knowledge that you're investing in our people, the Filipino people here that need God's love and outreaches here in the Philippines. So anyway, if you wanna find out more, just get in touch and you could even come to one of our outreaches at some point. And watch this space, pretty soon we'll be doing a ride for a cause. Woods Customs for the causes that we believe are important to God's heart and important to us. But we'll still have fun while we're doing it. Anyway, I'm Wood. Thank you for watching. And keep your eyes peeled because we got some more beats about to be released from this space. See ya.